Hey, Michael Church, Crawl Space Ninja. Today we're continuing our misconception series and we're going to talk about dehumidification and its role on mold. Does it make it go dormant or should it be utilized as a way to treat the mold? Stay tuned. If you're new to Crawl Space Ninja, we talk about crawl space encapsulation, mold remediation, and indoor air quality. We hope you'll subscribe to our channel, ring that notifications bell, and follow us on Facebook. A lot of companies out there do crawl space encapsulation and do very little mold remediation. And some, in order to get out of doing mold remediation, will go as far as to say that the dehumidification or the dehumidifier that they install will actually make the mold go dormant and even in some cases kill the mold. Well, I'm here to tell you that, you know, mold dormancy is kind of a weird term, okay? If you, if you think of like a groundhog or a bear, okay, when they hibernate, they are dormant. That doesn't mean they're dead, okay? So if you go in there and you poke the bear, the bear wakes up and he's ferocious, right? Well, it's the same with mold. If dehumidification is able to make mold go dormant, as soon as a water source is introduced, the mold is ferocious and wanting to spread and the dehumidification may not be enough to address the moisture problem, especially if you've got a leak from above that's causing, say, the wood to be wet around a toilet and mold starts to grow in that area. So the best thing to do is to completely remove the mold and apply a disinfectant and a protectant. Now, some people tell us that why do you offer a service where you don't remove the mold? Because, you know, we can't make you have us remove the mold. Some homeowners are okay with the mold visibly being there, but they want us to apply a disinfectant, uh, normally because of budgetary reasons. So we do have that option to where if we're going to address mold, we have the option of, of spraying an Anabec disinfectant on the mold in order to treat it. But I really, really want to encourage you to go ahead and have it physically removed and then properly soda blasted and treated and then X70 protectant applied to keep it from coming back. That is the best way to address mold in your crawl space. The dehumidifier is part of that process because the wood has to be dried out in order to start the mold remediation process. So it is part of it, but the dehumidifier is not gonna kill the mold or make it go dormant in the sense to where you never have to worry about it, especially if a future water leak comes. Michael Church, Crawl Space Ninja, we just want you to take care of that mold properly. We hope you'll make it a happy and blessed day. We'll see you later.